Hello, Rising fans. How are you? Um, it took me a while today. I finally got who I like to see go on to Raw and SmackDown and NXT in the upcoming draft this Friday night starting. So without further ado, here we go. So, on um, Raw, um, if Raw gets first pick Friday night, I'm thinking they're going to pick Cody Rhodes. If that's the case, Judgment Day is going to go to SmackDown. Which, actually, I'd love to see Judgment Day go to SmackDown, but it's hard to choose because who they're going to pick. Champions, if one brand's going to pick Austin Truth, I think they're going to stay on Raw or Austin Grace Ball. The other one will go to that brand. Same, same thing as Logan Paul. Now, Kevin Owens, Solo Soko and Tonga, Jimmy Uso and Jay Uso are going to go to Raw, I think. Drew McIntyre is going to stay on Raw. I can see him stay. Chelsea Green, yeah, keep her on Raw. I like to see from SmackDown go Nainomi because wherever Jimmy's going to go, Nainomi's going to go because they're a couple. Bianca Belair, she needs to go to Raw because she's done enough of as all she can on SmackDown. Jay Gargio. The New Day every draft gets traded back and forth constantly. Keep them on Raw. DIY, Omos, Tozawa, Maxine Dupree. I like to see the Foss or Randy Orton go to Raw. And the LWO face team, minus Kalido. Uh, I like to see CM Punk stay on Raw. Shayna Baszler is always Starks. So I like to see Nia Jax stay on NXT. Arvar, AOP, Karrion Cross. Um, that is Sensuke Nakamura. Natalia. I like to see actually go Chelsea Green go to NXT. Now, over on this side, SmackDown. They got to keep AJ Styles, the phenomenal one. They got to keep LA Knight. They need Bailey. They got to keep Braun Breaker. Bring up Baron Corbin to team up with Breaker. The Pride, because just like the New Day, every draft, Bobby Lashley Street Profits go back and forth. Keep them on SmackDown. From NXT, I like to see Hank and Tank be brought up. Over from Raw, I love to see Imperium go to SmackDown. Seth Rollins go to SmackDown. It's been a, chronic, a long time since he's been on the roster on SmackDown. Last time. It was on SmackDown in 2019. They did shit all nothing with them. So for this time, they actually do something with them. Becky Lynch, because they're married. The Creed Brothers. Love to see the Creed Brothers go to SmackDown. Same as Ivy Niles. Piper Niven. Break up that tag team of Niven and Chelsea. I like to see Damage Control stay on SmackDown. Same as the LWO Hill team. From NXT, I like to see Drag It Off go to SmackDown. Raw. I mean, from Raw, take Chad Gable, Otis, and Ricochet. Braun Strowman. Bring him to SmackDown. Take Sheamus to SmackDown. Pete Dunne, Ty the Bait, keep him them there. Kalito, keep him there. From NXT, I'd love to see these five people get caught up. Ali Valkyrie, Tatum Paxi, Joss Briggs, Jensen Brooks, Daisy Duke, because they've been working their asses off. There you have it, folks. That's what I'd love to see go to SmackDown, the 2024 draft. Minus who has ever champions, Raw don't take the opposite. Other backup choices would be going to SmackDown. And there's what I like to see the Raw roster look like. And NXT down there, uh, that's a given who they're taking. They might take, you know what? I'm going to change it. New Day, go to NXT. They're not doing enough of New Day. New Day, if they Raw don't take them, NXT would take New Day. There you have it, folks. Let me know below. Do you like these draft roster? Would you make any changes who you like to see on either brand? Um, who you love to see go to NXT, come up from NXT? Um, what champions would you like to see on Raw and SmackDown? But there we go. There's my dream wrist of what the 2024 draft rosters look like. I even them out for like talent wise and stuff. And uh, that all that. There we go. But stay tuned Friday night, folks. See how many of these I get right and how many I get wrong. Stay safe, everybody. Too sweet. Bye.